Now soon you'll know. Second shot at the par five ninth. I think this hole is going to get obliterated today. <laughs> I think you're know, right. It will with this 60, 104 eagles. Next level, but couldn't do it as no for the eagle and the lead. And soon you'll know. How about his front nine? We're in for a treat. To our leader, soon you'll know at 11. So just those overhanging limbs out to take it down. So aim for that front edge. Very well judged indeed. And he's missed back to back fairways mm. to the right after five in a row. No now, long range birdie effort. Uh huh. Yep. <laughs> Come on now. You have those days where it just everything. <laughs> It doesn't matter how far you are, you just say, well, I'll just hit it in that little hole over there. That's easy. At, at times. Well, soon you'll know he has a new driver, but this is less than driver here at the par 4 14th. Yeah, we've seen a number of guys lay up today. It's uh, over 320 to get all the way back to that flag. There's water left, bunkers to the right. So you may not have had enough firepower to get it there. So if you don't feel like you can fly it on the green, you know you can't go long or right. Our leader, soon you'll know, second shot at 14. Back down the hill, yep, well done. Going back to that shot for Tom Camlin. This is no at 14 to get to 18 under. How about you save part of the last under. hole and then uh, make this one, you feel like you might have picked up a shot and a half. Well done. Look at that. Soon you'll know here at the 15th. 220, a diabolical hole location up on the top of a significant shelf right there amazing you're able to land it there from 220 downwind and stop it soon you'll know this to get to nine under through 15. the two this would be it's difficult holes on the golf course soon you'll know is on fire great chance here 16 is one of the most difficult par fours on the golf course just because of the length for uh, 475 but Threatening the 50 number. Catch a piece of the fairway would be helpful. Uh, miss it that wide now from a front hole location coming to over the bunker. You might play that a little bit. Had 45 feet of. Yeah, he curve. likes to hit that that hard cut. Matsuyama yep. had two. Yeah, exactly. No second shot at the 16th. Yeah, okay, just trying to get it somewhere on the putting service or near it so you get the ball up and down. And Soon you'll know from the birdie, from excuse me, from the bunker trying to get up and down for a par. Yeah, so much green or grass to cover just to get to the green. That was always going to be awkward. Now soon you'll know. First time he's really had to try to save par from distance. He does it. What about that? Wow. One last roll. 68 <laughs> on the number. Soon you'll know at the par 317, the stadium hole. 145 yard back hole location. Uh, that's not his best either. Yeah, you know, sometimes you get to a point that we're speculating, but you're like, man, if I bury the last three holes. At the 17th, soon you'll know to get to 10 under. Well, make this if you can and try and eagle the last. Par five. Does he do it? Oh, soon you'll know. Still, He's got a chance. Still have a chance. 16 and now 17. Yeah. Carrying enough pace straight up the hill. His green reading has been impeccable and worthy of a, which is surprising. I think when you have a chance, you can even knock it over the green and pitch it in. But he just didn't feel comfortable with that narrow area of green, water front, some rough, and yeah, brilliant shot. 
Got a whole high, controlled the spin. Soon you'll know has this birdie putt right here for a 60. He's put it beautifully today. Uh, you'd want to finish it off in style. Out in 30, can you come home in 30? Soon you'll know. 11 under, a 60 here in the first round today at the AT&T Byron Nelson. What a round by no. Last year when he played at TPC Craig Ranch, missed the cut. Oh, what a turnaround. What a round of golf. What a day, man. One, one eagle, nine birdies, 11 under par, 60. I mean, what a special way to start the week. Uh, you know, it's an amazing day for me. And then I think it's like lowest lounge on PGA Tour in my career. I'm, so I'm happy with that. And then everything going perfect today, off, even off the tee through the, through the green. But after the hit, on number 12 on driver. My driver was crack on the, after, after the tee shot on 12. So I'm, I'm on, on, unexpected about shooting 60, but it's going pretty good today. Yeah, so talking about that driver, when that happened, I mean, like, kind of walk us through there. Did that sort of, you know, get you in a different state of mind with the driver because you were swinging it and, and driving the ball so well, but kind of what, what went on through that process? Yes, before on 12, I'm hitting almost every fairway and swinging pretty good and a lot of confidence off the tee. But after, uh, when I'm hitting on 12, I'm hitting, trying to hitting draw and pretty solid hit, but it's going, like, 70 yard right, so I'm, like, what does this come from? And then I was, uh, I was see uh, my driver and it, it, it was cracked. And then, you know, when I hit, and then after the third, uh, 12, I hit a driver again at, on 13. It was going like 50 yard left. And I'm a little scary about the two swings about, in, you know, it's coming up to next, uh, coming few holes. But I got a no driver. I got a no spare driver in the locker, and then finally uh, Henry got a same driver, but more loft on it, but he got the Callaway one, so. Okay, and then the, the second shot here at 18, 257 to the hole. I mean, did, did you have 59 in your mind? Like, what was going on through your mind through, that would cause the layup in that situation? I little think about it, uh, shooting 59. This is the, like, first thing I think is last. I, I don't think it's last, but this is the first time ever in my life shooting 59, trying to 59, but it was, it's like perfect three wood distance with the, into the wind, but if I need a like extra five to 10 more yards, I, I'm definitely go for it, but it's wind pretty good up there. So I'm just, just, just first day, you know, just trying to make birdie. So I'm just lay up. Well, you, you made birdie. You finished off the round nicely. Congratulations on a great day and a great start to the week. Good luck the rest of the way. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. To watch more, click here. To subscribe, click here.